What's up guys, I'm Justin Stenstrom from Elite Man Magazine and in this video I'm going to share with you why simplicity is the key to success and how to start thinking like Leonardo da Vinci. Because although da Vinci is thought of as being one of the smartest minds throughout history, one of the most greatest and brilliant geniuses that ever lived, the truth is da Vinci actually wasn't as smart as some of the other geniuses like say Albert Einstein where these guys just thought of incredible different things and new concepts and ideas that nobody else could think of. Da Vinci didn't actually have an analytical genius mathematical mind like that. He actually just broke things down to a simple simplistic level and was able to be creative from that point and do so many great things. In fact, one of his most famous quotes is just simplicity is the ultimate sophistication and it's one of my favorite quotes now because it applies to basically everything I do. Whenever I'm trying to do something new or whenever I'm trying to actually be more productive in my day-to-day -day life, I actually just think of this philosophy where I try to keep things as simple as possible because the more complex I make them, the harder it gets for me to actually do those things. And trust me when I say this, I am so much more productive on a day to day basis and so much more successful in the long term when I keep things simple. So let's dive into the actual reasons why you got to keep things simple as well. The first reason why simplicity is the key to success is overcomplicating the basics never has good results. See, when you overcomplicate things and you don't actually focus on the basics, you're essentially building out a house, building out the rooms, making different levels, making different floors, making all the rooms look nice and putting nice shit in the rooms, but at the end of the day, you don't actually have the foundation down in the house. So that house isn't really going to last long. It's probably going to crumble after a certain period of time, after you get burned out or after the structure of the house starts to fall apart because it was never really there in the first place. Whereas if you actually focus on the foundation of the house, if you focus on the basics in the beginning, you can actually put all your energy and effort into making it more sturdy and strong. So when you go on to build those other things, when you go on to add more floors to your house, it's going to actually be successful. You can actually do these types of things later on once you've laid down the foundation. I'm telling you, the basics or the foundation is where the success comes from. And it takes a certain amount of dedication and a certain amount of discipline to continually go after the basics and focus in this area. But the truth is you're going to see success so much faster when you do this. The second reason why simplicity is the key to success is you don't get caught up in the paradox of choice when you keep things simple. When there's so many different options, when there's so many different choices, when there's so many things we think we have to do and so many different roads and paths we think we have to go down to do those things, things get really complicated. Things get really frustrating. We actually feel very overwhelmed and actually the funny thing is even though we know or think we have so much to do, we actually do less. And that's really what the paradox of choice is. When there's so many different options, the funny thing is human beings will actually choose none of those options. They won't just choose a bunch of options because that's overwhelming to us. We choose none of those options. So again, instead of having so many different things to do, so many different choices, keep it very simple. Have one, two, three things at the most that you're doing at a time and even that's pushing it. The more you can focus on doing just one thing at a time, the faster your success is going to come. And this leads us right into the third reason why simplicity is the key to success because when you start to see success, when those results actually come faster because you're keeping things simple, you actually feel more motivated and uplifted to do more. It's basically like building up small wins over time. And when we start to see those wins, we start to see those successes, we actually feel more motivated. We feel more alive and we feel like we're doing the right thing. So we actually want to invest more of our time, more of our energy and get more done. And this cycle of success just keeps adding up and fueling you and building more and leading to more success. The momentum just carries you into doing more and more things and having more success. And the fourth reason why simplicity is the key to success or simplicity is the ultimate sophistication just like Leonardo da Vinci said is you spend less time actually planning and being in the hypothetical theoretical world and actually more time executing and being in the real world. There was a great American general, I believe it was Eisenhower, but I could be wrong. But basically what he said is planning is essential, but plans are useless on the battlefield. And what he meant is basically you do need to plan, you do need to have some type of strategy, but at the end of the day, it comes down to execution. And if you're spending all your time planning, you're spending all your resources and energy just thinking about what you're going to do without actually doing those things, you're going to get nowhere. And I think unfortunately in our day and age, so many people think that they're actually doing more than they really are, where they're actually 
thinking they're taking the right steps or doing the right research or planning and strategizing all the right things, but the truth is they're not actually executing like they need to be. But when you think like Da Vinci and you actually keep things simple, you're going to do a lot more executing and a lot less planning. But that's it for today, guys. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like below and also share in the comment section what you're going to do right now to start thinking more like Da Vinci. Also, make sure you subscribe to the channel on YouTube and hit the notification bell to get notified the instant we release a new video. And follow me on Instagram at Justin Stenstrom.